given point in units, contribution margin ratio given. Ocean Company sells a product with a contribution margin ratio of 80%. Fixed costs are $2,800 per month. What amount of sales in dollars must Ocean Company have to break even? If each unit sells for $30, how many units must be sold to break even? So we'll start out looking at required sales in dollars, and that's going to be calculated as our fixed costs plus our target profit divided by the contribution margin ratio. And so again, if we're looking at break even, target profit is zero. So we have fixed cost of 2,800 plus zero divided by a contribution margin ratio of 80%. Oops. And so if we say 2,800 divided by 80%, we get 3,500 as our answer as required sales in dollars to break even. And so what would required sales in units be? And so that's required sales in dollars divided by sales price per unit, which would be the 3,500 divided by 30 per unit, for a total of 116.67, but we need to round that up because we, we can't sell 0.67 units, so we should have used the round up function, and then our formula, comma, zero digits, close parentheses, and so it gives us 117 units. And then um, we could have also calculated this as fixed costs plus target, sorry, plus target profit divided by the contribution margin per unit and that would have been 2,800 plus zero divided by, we have a sales price of 30 and a ratio of 80%, so divided by $30 times 80%, and that would give us the same 117 units. So let's use the roundup function to begin with, equals roundup, open parentheses, 2,800 divided by, let's do another set of parentheses, 30 times 0.8, close parentheses, so that we're um, telling Excel to, to do this multiplication before it divides, Clo and then comma, and that is telling Excel we're done with our function, or our formula for the math. Now comma, how many digits do we want? Zero, close parentheses, for our roundup function, press enter, and we get the same 117 units. And we can extend the decimals to confirm that it did actually round up for us.